the story we've been covering for weeks, and it's finally here, the first day of school in Arkansas. Good evening. Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm in Kirikazuka. Students across the state will be returning to the classroom for the first time since the coronavirus pandemic forced them to go virtual months ago. KNWA's Lauren Krakow gives us a recap of what we know about how the districts are handling the returning of the school year for kids this during this pandemic. Over the last month, we've heard your concerns and we've asked your questions. I spoke with teachers, parents and students, and even doctors about the highly anticipated first day back to school. It's not that we don't want to be with our kids. I mean, I'm dying to see my students. I want to see them. We're just worried for our community, for ourselves, for our students. One more day. Nobody wants to get back to what was normal more than educators. That's all that's left until the reopening of Arkansas schools. I feel like going to in-person in school right now is disastrous. All summer school districts in our area have been trying to determine and best plan how school will function this fall. We have a lot of confidence in regard to having kids show up on campus day one. In Springdale, Superintendent Jared Cleveland says the district is implementing many changes like requiring masks, providing thermometers to teachers, and placing hand sanitizer all over the campuses. And we're trying to limit class sizes as much as we can with the three options of our curriculum delivery. We also have additional custodians that'll be spread out throughout all the buildings. In Fayetteville, the first day back will look pretty similar. We're definitely going to have a very ramped up cleaning protocol. Alan Wilburn with Fayetteville Public Schools says the district is as prepared for the unknowns of COVID-19 as it can be. We're working to be ready to make whatever the, the situation may be and try to look through the scenarios. Okay, what could possibly happen and can we be ready for it? If there's a positive case within a school, Kimberly Mundell with the Arkansas Division of Elementary and Secondary Education says the state will offer guidance directly which will vary by district. There's not a set threshold that we at the state can provide. If you have X number of cases, you must shut down. Those are decisions that are, are going to have to be determined as things go. Even with these plans in place, many educators like Kelly Riley, a local high school teacher, fear Arkansas isn't ready to reopen schools yet. And we're going to make sure everybody's thoroughly infected and exposed. And then we have to close for virtual so that every that's the thing I want to avoid. That's not the case for everyone. As you can see, many people have shared their thoughts on our Facebook page saying they're ready for schools to open and are glad to have some sort of normalcy again. Stay with us as we continue to cover this story. In Rogers, Lauren Craycall, KNWA Northwest Arkansas News. Thank you, Lauren. Now across the